might have noticed I haven't posted anything much for a while. That's because it's winter in New Zealand right now, it's raining, and there's not much opportunity to get out and about into the garden and do some serious rejuvenation, except for maybe some pruning and a bit of garden maintenance supports, which I've pulled out now that I've pruned back. But there's not much happening except for weeds and maybe I'm going to get a few spring bulbs soon they're just starting to make their uh, presence known. So this is Carol from Y Garden in the middle of winter in New Zealand wanting to know what on earth else to do because it's so wet all the time and frosty but not snowing and not flooding so to some extent that's a good thing. So one of the things I have been pruning are these red dogwoods. I got them for several reasons. One is that you can use the canes to be a woven basketry or useful around the garden as cages on your plants. Also they have this beautiful red stem in, in winter once all the leaves have gone and they do have some lovely changes of autumn colour. So what I've done so far with those, I gave them a little prune. I'm not quite sure how to do it, but I did. And then I've got these beautiful red stakes. They're just going to be in a vase in my house. And the other thing I have made, I'm rather keen on making wreath plants, which are very supple. And I've been able to make some wreaths, which will be the basic cage for a garden plant. For instance, I might find something that's struggling, not too many things here. Put that round there as the base and put some hoops from other branches of the same dogwood up over that and cover it so it gets a little bit more protection. So that's some natural ways of recycling and growing trees that you can use for other purposes than just to be small trees in the garden. And of course one of those things to do one of these dreary days is to get into my garden shed and to organise things a bit more, clean a few tools, make sure I can find things for the spring when I want to come in here and work. So I have some tools up on here nicely done and some things actually in need of finding a home. Nice working shed with all my natural fertilisers there and out back through the the door again to the garden. So there's a quick tour of things I could do when I get the motivation to try and get into the garden again. So this is Carol from Y Garden. We'll see you on the next video.